So what's your girl fine ass Bambi been up to? Jesus? So your girl Bambi from Love and Hip Hop Atlanta posted some very uh, interesting shit up on Instagram recently just that just had me like, really Bambi? For really? So basically, your girl Bambi posted this really screwed up message, right? And a lot of people were saying that <laughs> she's talking about a little scrappy. What it says is no black woman should be in a relationship with a black man and feel like she signed to death row records. And Bambi said, Crip walk my ass right up out that shit, cuz fuck out of here. I mean, I, I would think that no person at all should be made to feel that way. Apparently, black women are above everybody else and they're the only ones that should be treated that way. It doesn't say no one should be in a relationship with a with, with anyone and feel like they're signed to death row records. No, it's no black woman should be in a relationship with a black man. So what if a white man or an Asian man treats you like shit, it's okay. The entitlement, man, a lot of black females really think that black males owe them something automatically. That's not the way life works. Now, I have no problem with somebody posting the same message, but rewording it to say that no one should be in a relationship with anyone and made to feel as if they were signed to death row records. I have no issue with that. But I do have a, a problem with the word records being spelled with a Z. I didn't know that they spelled it that way. That's very stupid. Why wouldn't they just spell it with an S? But anyways, the point is this though. At the end of the day, nobody should be you know abused or mistreated. So <laughs> to point out gender or race in this, it just doesn't make any sense. And I, I don't know. It's just really hard for me to believe that Scrappy wasn't anything but good to Bambi because she was great for him. I've always said that, you know, and I'm not just saying this because Bambi's a dime. Don't get it twisted because some of y'all are like, oh, you just saying that because she fine as hell. She got ass. No, I'm not saying that. <laughs> no, Bambi's fine as shit, but that's not why I'm saying this. I mean, seriously, though, she was so good to Scrappy. She was a really great woman for him. And them breaking up broke my heart because they were one of my favorite couples, like as far as entertainers are concerned easily they were up there because I, I i just like the way that 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 they the way that they talk to each other the way that they interact with each other they, they were like best friends who were in a relationship i thought that that was always really cool and you know i thought that they were a, a positive example of a couple i know that they had their little their little issues here and there but you know for the most part bambi and scrappy were like a <laughs> pretty much I, I i'm not gonna say a perfect match but about as close to perfection as you're going to get because nothing's going to be perfect but shit they, <laughs> they were pretty close i would say a, a eight and a half out of ten yeah 8.5 out of ten easily or a nine and you know when i saw a little scrappy get down on his knee and he proposed to bambi on love and hip-hop and lean i think it was season five boy i was so happy you know i i, I was like scrappy you making a smart move that's that's what you need to do you really need to put a ring on her before for shoot, she move on to find somebody else, you know. I I, t I don't know why how a chick like Bambi could stay on the market as long as she did, you know, is it, you know. But anyways, man, and, and not just because of the way she looks. I mean, t she was really, really there for Scrappy, like, very good woman for him. But this is all my opinion. What do I know? Man, I, I need to stop fronting like I'm not biased. I am biased because she's a dime, okay. But anyways, Team Bam, full life. Little Scrappy's my dude and everything, but Scrap, you need to tighten up. You need to do whatever you need to do to get back in her good graces. You know that she's the one. You know you're not going to find a woman better than a goddamn Bambi. So you, you need Scrappy. Like, if I knew Scrappy, I will be shaking him right now. I'll be like, Scrappy, what the fuck is wrong with you, bro? What the fuck, man? Shit, I'll be like, Scrappy, do you know what you done did? You done lost the Bam. But anyways, man, this is all my opinion. Man, I'm seeing pretty good for life. Y'all knew that I was going to have nothing but great things to say about Bambi. Y'all knew, knew damn well that I was going to say this. That Scrappy needs to do whatever he needs to do to get back in her good graces and get back with her. Y'all knew I was going to say that, Jesus. But anyways, this is all my opinion. What do I know? Just a huge Bambi fan with the microphone. Let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at... Meet Magazine, Meet Magazine 7 on Google+, Meet Magazine blog and Instagram. Be sure to hit that notification button. It's right next to the subscribe button. It looks like a bell. Once you click that button, you'll be sent alerts. You'll be notified when new videos get posted.